This is the story of Rabbi Herschel Yalis's life. The Sambor Rebbe Rabbi Herschel Yalis, a direct descendant of the Baal Shem Tov, passed away at the age of 82. And Rabbi Yalis was born in Klausenburg in Hungary. And here is a picture of his hometown during that era. Now Rabbi Yalis's great-grandfather, Reb Uri Misambor, Reb Uri Yalis, was the first Sambor Rebbe who unfortunately we don't have any pictures of, was McCarve in Tabels by the Sar Shalom of Bells, Rav Shalom Rokeach. Rabbi Yalis was the fifth Sambor Rebbe. The first one, as I said, was Reb Uri. The second one was his son, Reb Yehuda Tzvi Yalis. The third one, who was Rabbi Yalis's uncle, was the Sambor Rav in Philadelphia, Rabbi Ephraim Eliezer Yalis. The fourth one, who was Rabbi Yalis's father, was Rabbi Lazar Yalis. And the fifth one was Rabbi Herschel Yalis. Rabbi Yalis was a unifier, so if you were to ask him what he thought about the people who thought that the Lubavitcher Rebbe was Mashiach, he would say, I do not like to talk about it because I do not like to talk about things that divide Jews. Rather, I prefer talking about things that unify Jews. How Sambor is related to Bells, Satmer, and Square, and where Rabbi Yalis is buried. The Vizhnitzer Rebetzin, who passed away 23 years ago, was the first cousin to Rabbi Yalis and was the mother of today's Bells Rebetzin, Satmar Rebetzin, and Skver Rebetzin. And that's how Rabbi Yalis was related to those three Hasidus, and that's why Rabbi Yalis was buried in Skver. <laughs>